And it looks like our heart streak has finally been broken. Eh. Well, we haven't found anything for the past 20 minutes. What's this thing? Do we kill it? Hello everybody! You can call me Bloody. And welcome back to Terraria. We're continuing our journey into Cataclysm. But we're not quite there yet. Perhaps we'll continue our search for the Sky Islands later, once we get some better armor. We found a Sky Island, it had some wings, along with some other stuff. But due to us being inflicted with the Medium Core Curse, we thought it'd be best to let Ashen here have the wings. We'll just have to try our luck in the next Sky Island that we find, whenever that happens. Yeah, it was quite the journey getting our butts up here. Even more so in finding these Sky Islands in the first place. But in the meantime, we'll just tear this thing apart and we'll use the scrap to do uh, something with it. Not really sure what, but uh, we don't really need sunplate blocks at the moment. Maybe we can sell it or whatever. Thankfully, Sky Islands have minerals as well, so we might as well take that too. Back to the mining. Right, we need more health, and to do that, we need to find heart crystals. Eventually, we did find our first heart crystal. Unfortunately, it was being protected by its guardian, that uh, yellow slime right there. Now we could rush in there, swinging with the sword, but just in case we'll play it safe and try to get it in a more roundabout method. Yeah! We beat the boss, and we got a boomerang statue, as a reward for that. Ah, uh, it's just like Final Fantasy. We find some crystals, and then we gotta fight some monsters of some eldritch horrors for it. Now then, how do we get out of here? Safely, at least. Well, we could have mined an exit in a different direction, but Bloody wanted to see how many slimes we could throw down this pit. Plus, we can get some minerals right over here. So, two birds, one stone. Now then, slimes, get in there! It's probably got some uh, tasty NPCs in there to snack on. Oh, that's right, in all that confusion, Bloody almost forgot to use this thing. On to more mining. We don't know exactly where we are going, but we'll find something of value eventually. Hopefully some more hearts, or maybe some treasure, who knows. Another heart, more health. That's what I'm talking about. Let's see here. Any more hearts down here? Oh, and some slimes. Nah, no, I guess not. Well, there's a chest that we can loot. We need some cobwebs to make some beds. And the necro armor. Whenever we get around to that. We don't need this painting, but we're gonna take it anyways. As a memento from our expedition today. With this, we've got a wild band of regeneration, as in the more health, and the faster that we can recover HP, the better. Mining downwards seems to be the best idea for us so far. We found a lot of hearts today, so that's a very good thing. And it looks like our heart streak has finally been broken. Eh. <sighs> Well, we haven't found anything for the past 20 minutes. What's this thing? Do we kill it? It's just that it's been a long time since Bloody has played this game. So, I don't really know if this thing is friendly or not. But I do at least know that this game likes to do that sort of stuff every now and then. Where a monster might look friendly, but they'll somehow one-shot you if you're not careful. That happened to me when unicorns were introduced into this game, way back then. But anyways, we found some more hearts, thanks to Navi right here. Alright, we got another heart now. We're making progress. Meanwhile, how are things going on your end, Ashen? Oh, 
Ashen is fish food right now. Pretty sure Ashen is hunting for weapons in the corruption. Well, good luck with that. We found another house to loot. There was a bookshelf and another treasure chest. What do we have here? A warding shoe spike. Now we get to climb walls and raise our defense. That's awesome. For someone on medium core, this can be a very good thing. Also at one point we found a lucky horseshoe, but we just forgot to equip it. While we're at it, we also found this huge seam of platinum ore. As well as a bunch of other stuff for our TNT and detonator collection. Hooray! Ashen, we're doing great down here. How's the surface? Well, that's that. Time to mine all the stuff and go make some awesome weapons, armors, and some other stuff with this. And that's all that I have to show you for now. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you for watching.